Well, my tiger barbs are settling in. Exploring. And once they're done there, I'll, I'll put Homer in. Try to fix up the plants a little more, maybe. Well, it's been a couple days now. Homer's settled in. Hey, Homer. Yeah, and the Tiga Barbs are liking the extra space. As you can see, they're all rough flying around. It's better than a 10 gallon for them, that's for sure. You see, they're chasing each other around, having fun. Now, these here ain't doing so well, but they're doing all right. If they get good enough roots into the gravel, they'll do all right. I just need to get my root tabs in. That'll help them out a lot. Hey, Homer. <laughs> there we go. I'm moving some fish around and got some new stuff in, too. Take this guy out of my goldfish tank and put him in with my other, other one. This one here, probably pick on him again. But they'll get along after he figures out who's boss. I got new plants in too. I moved in. See right there in the middle of the screen too as well. And I got another one in there. I moved the other ones over here. This used to be my loach tank. You'll see that it's no longer a loach tank right now at the moment. Plan on getting angelfish. Yeah, I'm bringing my loach. Hey, guy. Yeah, I'm gonna bring him back to the store there and probably pick up an angelfish. This guy here, I've tried him in a lot of my tanks. He's so big, he just tries to, any slow moving fish, like my koi, angel fish, anything small, like the platys were fine, but uh, he likes to suck the slime coat off my fish. It's either just this one guy here by himself that he's got that attitude, but uh, I don't know if that's indicative to all the mother loaches or just this particular one. But, uh, yeah, I've had him for a long time, but as you can see, he's pretty big. Anyway, he's going back to the store today. Right, Snow Kitty? Yeah. As you can see, I traded the roach for a plant. Some people say, you're crazy. <laughs> you don't get that much when you trade fish in. That's what I say.